What's going on guys? Another Saturday means a brand new batch of Ultimate Legends and Madden Ultimate Team. So let's go ahead and start it out by taking a look at the collection reward of Jonathan Ogden. We're going to take a look at his stats, see how much he's going for. 280,000 coins. Let's go ahead and flip him over and see what his stats are looking like. So he's got 96 in both run block footwork as well as pass block footwork. Looks like he has 97 in impact blocking awareness and 98 in pass block strength as well as strength. But you guys see the boost it gives plus 2 to pass block. He has plus 9 to short pass, plus 9 to ground and pound chemistries. This is your collection reward Jonathan Ogden. So you guys can go ahead and pick it up for 280,000 coins or you can knock out the collection. Now when I recorded this video the other ultimate legends which are in packs we're not on the auction block, so I'm just going to go ahead and show them to you on the screen. Starting with William the Refrigerator Perry, we're going to see that he has 92 Awareness, 93 Pursuit, 97 Tackling, with 98 Strength as well as Power Move. But check out the Block Shed at 101. He gives plus 3 to Strength, so that's also 101 as well. He gives plus 10 to Pass Rush plus 10 to run stuff chemistries an amazing refrigerator parry card if you ask me so now we're going to go ahead and take a look at the last and final ultimate legend impacts this week with the night train lane he has 98 speed as well as agility 99 in awareness and press 100 play rec 101 zone 102 man and he gives plus three to man coverage so this card is just absolutely sick all the way around and he gives plus 9 to pass rush, plus 10 to zone defense chemistries. I now understand why none of these are up at the current moment. So we're going to go ahead and jump into some packs and hopefully I can pull one of these cards. Alright, let's see what we can pull. I think I'm going to blow through about 90 grand here in packs. Let's reveal all for pack number 1. Really didn't help us out there. You guys see all of the bronze cards. We're looking for Ultimate Legends and Ultimate Legends only. Come on, Ultimate Team. It's been a while since I've pulled an Ultimate Legend. That's why I'm looking for one right now. I would love to pull any one of those guys. Let's see what we're going to have here. Come on, Ultimate Team. TJ Lang in pack number two. Now, right now, I have every single one of the Cover Vote collectibles. Not that hard to come by. So you guys could let me know if you're stocking up on those collectibles as well. Waiting for the cover vote to be announced so we get that 99 overall player we got darren coolidge here not really anything too spectacular but at least i have all the cover vote cards and i'm waiting for that collection i don't really think that the reward for the cover vote collection is gonna be that high since almost everyone has all the cards but we can just sit back wait and see never know what's gonna happen what are we gonna have here LaShawn mccoy nice little shady rookie card Stevie Brown, 75 overall card. Let's turn this pack opening around. Also in packs right now, we have brand new free agents. So who knows, maybe we'll come across one of these guys. Let's go backwards, why don't we? Alright, what are we going to get? Jeff Fisher, Chris Williams, Samson Statale, and of course Andre Ellington. Andrew Luck did not give us much luck in that pack. We have more golden tickets tomorrow, and I can confirm 100% guys we're going to have a golden ticket Michael Vick. If this is the last slated golden tickets, you can best believe that there will be a golden ticket Michael Vick. Whoever pulled it and redeemed it said they were making one. We haven't seen it yet, so you can only guess that it is coming tomorrow. Let's reveal all here. Looks like we got a shady collectible for the cover vote, but I already have that. Actually, guys, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put this on the trade block. And I'm going to put it up for, let's just say, two days. And at the time of me doing this video, it's about 11.30 a.m. Central Time. So you guys can go ahead and offer anything you want to on this card. And I'll just accept something at random, help you guys out by getting one of those cover vote collectibles. Maybe reveal all in this pack will change another Andrew Luck. Come on, you got to give us more luck than you did last time. Reveal all! 76 overall Mo Claiborne with a CJ Mosley. All right, at least it was better than the last time we got luck. Also, I haven't really been keeping up with the market and the prices of the golden tickets that have been released so far, but I do believe that of all the golden tickets, Andrew Luck is the cheapest golden ticket right now, going for at a little under 200,000 coins. I apologize if I'm wrong about that, but I do believe that is around the price range 
for his golden ticket card. So what are we going to have here, guys? Come on. We got a Jarrell Powell, Isaac Sopawaga, and Haloti Nada. They also had the finals of the Mutt Invitational yesterday. So if you guys were home and watched all those games, they were pretty entertaining. I'm not going to lie. There were some hiccups, you know, with the stream dying out a few times. You know, the servers went down during one of the games. And whoever was running the graphics during the last and final game actually kept the banner covered up the whole time. I don't know what the deal was there, but I have heard that the game was pre-recorded. I don't know why you would pre-record a live stream, especially for the biggest game of the day. I don't know what their motive was for that, but it was pre-recorded nonetheless, and a lot of people were kind of upset with that. So how do you guys feel? You know what? These last four packs, I'm just going to reveal every single one of them. Hopefully it'll change our luck around. Here's number one, and we end up pulling 93 overall Golden Tate. Definitely a way to start it off by pulling a 90 plus overall card. Alright, here it is. Pack number two, we're starting it off with a 70 overall tight end of John Phillips. Reveal all, 92 overall Trent Cole. Looks like the 90 trend players is staying alive with Golden Tate and now Trent Cole. We also pulled our rookie Fitzgerald. Let's see what other type of card we can have. Maybe we could even pull one of those Ultimate Legend collectibles. Early enough in the day we could get a decent amount of coins for that. So let's reveal all in this pack. Alright, so we got Janoris Jenkins. Uh, the last and final pack. Come on, William Perry. Let's see a Night Train Lane. Let's go. And we end up pulling a Gold Chase Blackburn. You guys know we did not get anything that was worth some major coins. But I had to try with these amazing Ultimate Legends in the game. You know, I had to jump on here. I had to rip some packs. I'm not giving up on them. I'm not because golden tickets are tomorrow. I plan on getting a bundle. I plan on opening packs on both consoles. So hopefully my chances are going to increase of pulling one of those guys tomorrow. And let me know how excited you guys are for the last batch of golden tickets of the original promo. Now maybe they're going to drop some golden tickets in the game for the guys that won the Mutt Invitational. We're going to have to stay tuned and see what they do there. But hopefully you guys are having some luck and let me know if you pulled any of these Ultimate Legends. Make sure you guys shatter the like button if you want to see more. Subscribe if you're new. And until next time guys, Roll Tide.